Hello YouTube, this is Dazza the Cameraman. Today is March 3rd, 2013 UTC and it's that time of year again uh, where we are seeing uh, reports on YouTube of a huge unidentified object eclipsing the Sun uh, like this video here by uh, Mayenhausen74 uh, let's just take a quick look. Breaking news, the sun was eclipsed by a huge unidentified object March 2, 2013. Let's have a look at the images from SDO. And we can see that something appears to be eclipsing the sun. So what could it be? Okay, we're going to take a look at what's going on here in Starry Night Pro. Here we are looking towards the Earth from the center of the Sun. Uh, it's easier to um, take the view from this way. Uh, things are a little bit clearer in this view as to what's going on. As you can see, I've got SDO Mark. That's a Solar Dyna Dynamics Observatory. It's in a geostationary orbit around the Earth and you can see that I've got the date set to the 28th of February and we're just going to run this forward, I've got the, the time is obviously um, running faster at this time we're coming up to 1st of March here, coming around the back ok I'll just stop that and run it forward manually ok you can see that the STO on the 1st of March is just sort of coming across the, the top of the um, the back side of the Earth um, and then if we run it again you'll see STO coming around and it's um, next geostationary orbit so around onto the front side of the Earth now again we're looking from the Sun and we're now into the 2nd of March UTC and as we come around I'll just zoom in on this for you and run this forward manually so we're just skirting right across the top there and the view from the SDO camera can actually see the earth uh, coming into view we're just skirting through the atmosphere a little bit too by the looks of it uh, let's zoom back out again and what's going to happen over the next few days is that this um, so-called mystery object or UFO which is actually the earth is going to become more obvious in the SDO images and we're going to see this as, as we come around again I'll just speed this up so we get around a bit faster so by the next pass today 3rd of March, it's 3rd of March here in New Zealand, it's 3rd of March UTC now I'll just zoom that in again and run it forward you can see that the um, SDO, Solar Dynamics Observatory, is actually eclipsed by the Earth now. So the next image that we will see, the Sun will actually be completely eclipsed by the Earth as it passes around. Remember we're looking through the Earth here, SDO is actually behind the Earth. Now the same thing is going to happen on the um, 4th of March, I'll just step this forward days. Um, so this is the 3rd of March and if I step this forward you can see that SDO is further down behind the Earth and will continue to get further behind the Earth until um, it actually emerges out of the way of the Earth which will be around about the 22nd of March looking at Starry Night Pro okay now we're looking from the other side uh, we're looking at uh, STO here um, and this is the earth we've got the time set to um, 0500 hours on the 2nd of March 2013 and again I've got time uh, speeded up so let's have a look and see what happens here comes the Sun and we're hovering with STO and we can see that the Sun is going to be slightly eclipsed on the second round about 0700 hours which is exactly what happened and if I just speed this up let's just follow as that comes around again so the Sun's on the back side of STO it's coming around again and there it is this is tomorrow 
3rd of March or later today as it will be and let's carry on let's go around again and here comes the sun there it is again let's run that forward slowly and around again I think we get the idea this is going to be happening over the next several days and no doubt there'll be lots of YouTube videos saying that something massive has passed in front of the Sun. So that's all it is. It's the STO Solar Dynamics Observatory orbiting the Earth. The Earth is between the Sun and the satellite. And that's all we're seeing. It's not Nibiru, it's not Planet X, it's not a UFO. It's not anything other than the Earth. Thank you for watching. As always, do check out my Facebook discussion page, Voices of Reason to Explain X or Vortex. I'll put a link for you in the description area. Thank you for watching.